the fermentation of bioreal organic yeast, the worldwide unique production process. It begins in the laboratory with the addition of a nutrient solution consisting of organic cereal and fresh spring water. This preparatory culture is then shaken and not stirred for 24 hours. Then the three-step fermentation process begins. The preparatory culture from the laboratory is put into the first fermenter. The yeast cells multiply rapidly. When making organic yeast, compared to conventional yeasts, no additional growth boosters have to be used. Organic yeast grows simply on the basis of the nutrients contained in the cereals upon which it's fermenting. During fermentation, samples are regularly taken for the laboratory to ensure that product quality is consistently high. The yeast concentration is measured using special light beams. It then continues to the third and final fermenter with a capacity of 50,000 litres and which provides new nutrients for the organic yeast. After another 20 hours of fermentation, the result is organic yeast milk. Unlike conventional yeast, no chemical additives are used at any point during the production process. That's why the organic yeast doesn't have to be rinsed to remove unpleasant flavours and odours once the fermentation process is complete. That means the environment is spared tons of contaminated wastewater. Some of the liquid is removed from the yeast. That makes the yeast milk thicker, which is why it's referred to as yeast cream. This paste is then used to make bioreal yeast cubes, for example, which are pressed and then carefully packed. The yeast cream can also be dried, giving bakers a durable alternative to fresh yeast. It's also possible to further process the cream into organic yeast flakes, an ideal product for vegans and vegetarians. So that's how it's done. The unique production process for bioreal organic yeast.